What's up YouTube, Dale here from Zephyr War Games bringing you a great box opening of the Dark Illusions. Um, so this is the new main set to be coming out of Konami and it's all about the return of the Ultimate Wizard Dark Magician. There are some amazing cards in this set. It's also the release of uh, Metaphos as well for those of you that are out there that want to catch those. Uh, the good news for those that want Metaphos is that they're all like rares, a couple of supers, so they won't be too hard to get. Uh, there's also Cosmic Cyclone and the new TCG exclusives of Spyros and Ter Terraforms. Can't remember the names off the top of my head, uh, but we'll soon find out. So, without further ado, we're going to crack straight into these and see how we do. Um, I'm not going to spend too long on the commons. Uh, and as we go on, I'll, I won't be spending too long on the supers. But Trimid Master, that's not too bad. And Metaformation, it's a really nice field spell for the Metaphos. Um, continue with the rest of the commons there. Obviously, let's bring the trains as well. So the Metaformation is a really nice card for those. So we'll put that one down there. Um, let's crack straight into the second pack. From the Ultras, I'm mainly looking for the, uh, the new Trap Hole. That's a pretty good card to have. Trimid Crusher. And Magician of Dark Illusion. There's our first Dark Magician Super that we need. Uh, that's very nice. And obviously for me as a Dark Magician nut, it's the Dark Magician stuff that I want to be hunting. I've got quite a lot of it from uh, sneak peeks and stuff like that and trades. Um, but obviously the secrets is, is what's what I'm missing and what I'm hunting for. Um, so, just go through. Oh, first Ultra. Nice. Um... Master pe uh, masterpiece, the true Drake as well. That looks pretty nice. Quite a nice card for the Ultra on that one. Uh, and then the rest of the commons. So yeah, it's, it's mainly the Dark Magician stuff that I'm hunting. High Paladin's also a nice one. Uh, and then the, the Pot of Desires, which Lynn like perfume. Which I'm not too fussed about the pot, to be totally honest. I mean, I, I, I like one or two. I, I just don't think I, I see it in many of my decks, that, uh, that, but you know that can change. Like I said, I'm mainly hunting the Dark Magician stuff. Toon Dark Magician, that's nice. Uh, the artwork's pretty cool as well. So that's another nice card to get. Um, but yeah, it, it, it's quite hard if you want to build the Dark Magician stuff because they've made like the Circle and the Navigate, which you need most, harder to uh, get. Uh, there's our second ultra. Premature return. Banish one card from your hand, then target one of your banished monsters, special summon it in face down defense position. It's not too bad for a, like a zombie deck. That would really help out a zombie deck, actually. Because uh, you want to get. You can banish one of your Shiranui cards from your hand that's stuck in your hand, uh, get the effect of that to pop, and then you get to special summon one of your banished monsters anyway. Uh, so moving on, there's another super. Ibon High Magician. Nice. Um, now, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure it's getting a reprint in the tins coming up, which is uh, not that far away. Um, so, I don't know whether they'll rarity bump that or how that will go. It's, like, it's nice to be in Super because it's easier to get, but I would have much preferred him in Secret um, and maybe Circle or Navigate, but we know why Navigate and Circle have been put into uh, Metapho Combination. That's not too bad either. We know why he's been put into Super and the others have been put into Secret because that's just the way Konami rolls. So, on to pack number two, four, six, eight. So, on to pack number nine. And uh, another Super R Lunar Light perfume. So, for those of you that are that collected Lunar Lights from the previous set, um, you're going to be wanting that. It's basically like a Lunar Lights personal monster reborn. So. It's a very nice card to get, and it's super, so it's a little bit easier for everyone to get. Spiroid Quick Fix, and Magician of Dark Illusion. So, I mean, commons and rares I'm not too fussed about, because I saw quite a few of them at Sneak Peaks and stuff like that. And like I said, it's, it's some Dark Magician secrets that I'm hunting. Uh, a Coral Dragon would be nice. Uh, Cosmic Cyclone would also be quite nice to get. Um, Salt Blackwing. So, that's not too bad. Last pack on this side, this is interesting. Hope that both the secrets are either both at the bottom. I'm seeing if there's a pattern as there was in the previous ones. Nope, there's the ultra though. Shirinui Solitaire. 
I don't know if I like the name Solitaire. Like, I've talked to some people about it. Some like it, some don't. It's not bad. Um, but it, it's, yeah, it's a definitely a must-have card for your zombie deck, it, especially if you're running the Shiranui engine. Uh, another Assault Blackwing. So, uh, that was on that side. So that was the first half of the box in those lot there. We'll go for a recap at the end, don't worry. Uh, and then this is the first one on this side. So, surprisingly enough, I've gone through half the box and I still haven't seen a secret. So, um, oh, number 81, Super Dreadnought Rail Cannon. That's a, a nice card to get for those of you for your numbers collection. And of course, anyone that's using trains. And he is just a generic rank 10. And it's a pain to get rid of. I mean, 4k defense, 3200 attack. And it's like you detach and uh, it's unaffected. Uh, Amaterasu, again, a really nice card to get. It's nice that it's super because it's easy to get. It would be nicer if it was in like a secret or an ultra. Um, because it's not going to be a card that's going to be played a hell of a lot. But it's still a really good card. Uh, meta Formation. I'm getting really concerned. I'm two secrets short and two ultras short so far. And I've gone through four of the 12 on the right side so far. Salt Blackwing. Uh, I've got to start speeding this up now. I mean, all the supers are a bit repetitive, uh, and so are the rares. But again, we'll do a recap at the end. There's the next Ultra Tyrant Red Dragon Archfiend. It looks amazing. It looks really nice. Uh, I'm not an Archfiend player myself, um, but uh, you know, I know I know the worst of some of those cards. They're really nice cards. Uh, burning through this one. Uh, Metaphor's combination. I am still getting very concerned. I've opened up a whole box and I haven't seen a single secret yet. And with the ratio supposed to be two secrets a box, each pack is getting me more and more nervous. <laughs> um, this will either be the best pack in the best set in the world and I'll get some nice secrets towards the end. There we go, there's our first secret. Took us long enough. Uh, Pot of Desires. So not the main one that I was hunting, but still a very nice card. I know quite a lot of people are after this one. So um, yeah, there's, there's our first secret. Um, and hopefully it will lead on to more to come. So, no, oh, Lunar Light Perfume. How many packs have we got left? Two packs left. Something tells me I've got a misprinted box and I don't like that. Misprint me an extra ultra. Oh, I'm going to be a secret short, aren't I? Please, 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 please be the secret in this one. Otherwise, this is a very disappointing box. Yeah, it's a secret, and it's a Coral Dragon. <sighs> that was quite a nerve-wracking pack. I was really concerned I wasn't going to get the second secret then. <laughs> but again, yeah, Coral Dragon, um, if it'll focus, is a nice nice card as well. It's a generic, generic synchro, level 6. Once per turn, you discard one card, then target one card your opponent controls, destroy it. If the Synchro Summon card is sent from the field to the graveyard, you can draw one card. You can only use the effect of, uh, you use this effect of Coral Dragon once per turn. So it's basically a, a rank 6 draw card. So, after that nerve wracking moment, it wasn't so bad. I got everything and kind of, everything we needed from that one. Um, so we'll go with, let's move the secrets to one side, loads of supers, the four ultras. There we go, right. So supers just flash through, there's quite a lot of those. Um, pretty much the standard supers that you need. I mean, Rod we haven't seen yet. Um, but yeah, pretty much standard on the supers. Uh, ultras were pretty good, not too bad with those. Masterpiece, uh, Premature Return, Shurinu Solitaire, and Tyrant Red Dragon Archfiend. So they're quite good. Uh, and then the two secrets are pretty cool as well. So Pot of Desires and Coral Dragon. Uh, can't complain about those. They're, they're both really good, quite good cards to get. So thanks for watching. Don't, go, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share the channel for us. Uh, we'll bring you more box openings and everything else very, very shortly. So uh, from our friend, good friend Donald... Happy dooling.